Statue Hunter 75 coming here to you with another Statue Forum review on statueforum.com. <clears throat> the music playing in the background is from the Halo Combat Evolved Anniversary Edition original soundtrack. Uh, the artists are Paul Lipson, Lenny Moore, Tom Saita. Just wanted to let you know the song in case you were wondering. This piece is amazing. It's number 174 out of 750. Unfortunately, like an idiot, I passed on the um, exclusive and missed out on it. I'm more of a, you know, Gears of War fan. I do like Halo. I played all the Halos, but I'm just not a huge Halo fan. I'm much better at Gears of War than Halo and Call of Duty, but Halo is cool. Don't get me wrong. I don't want to hurt all the Halo fanboys out there, so I do like Master... I love Master Chief. I should have got either the blue Spartan or the red Spartan, but I passed on those too. Um, and I had my chance at those. I had my chance at this too. <clears throat> then actually Sideshow did a thing where they were offering 20% off for this promotion for all their statues. And then they weaseled out and said, oh no, it's only for new subscribers to our website to Sideshow. So they were like, oh, well, we'll at least offer you 10%. And I said, forget that. And I said, forget it. Cancel my order. Because it was just the regular. And then it came out and it sold out everywhere. And the thing is freaking huge and freaking amazing. I saw all the reviews. I was like, oh, my God. I rushed back to Sideshow's website. I got on the wait list for the regular. And luckily, my wait list converted. And I got this beautiful big bastard right here, Master Chief, in all his glory. <clears throat> so these are the switch out arms of course I'm not gonna change the arms because I love him with the pulse rifle here and it's kind of a pain in the butt because they're they're pegs that stick in they're not uh, magnets so I'll just show you these in detail this is the uh, other arm that comes with the blaster the handgun whatever you call it <clears throat> It shows you the size of it. It's huge. Nice big quarter scale piece. It's color labeled so you know the whites go with the whites. And these two are yellow. And this hand is separate too. It comes off with a peg. I got it in there pretty tight so I'm leaving it on. This is the other hand. Just the hand that, that catches the, the, you know, the gun here. So. I still have a cold so please excuse my sniffling. Some might say this base is pretty plain, but you know what? I think it's perfect. It's like an alien planet. It's a muddy rock. It takes nothing away from all the glory that is this Master Chief premium format. And <laughs> I don't have a real nitpick to give about this statue. I love it. I'm so happy I got it. The detail on it is amazing. Right down to like, you know, the fabric under his armor. It's just amazing. It's battle damage. These aren't scratches. That's for effect. The detail is impeccable. I love how they went with the uh, with the shiny helmet. Really cool. Nice little mirror. Um, <clears throat> one critique. My only critique. I just wish they did the honeycomb helmet with the line going across like the McFarlane one um, but the McFarlane one is based on Halo 4 I'm not sure which Halo this is which Master Chief this is based on this might be Halo 1 2 or 3 or ODST or you know one of those so maybe that's why it doesn't have the honeycomb and it just has the shiny metal either way it looks amazing like look at that it is so Master Chief it's so cool I am so psyched to own this so cool. The detail on it is amazing. That looks like a light. That's paint. That little green thing there is the, you know, the palm of his hand. It looks like an electric light up. That's paint. That's how cool it is. Look at that metallic paint. Doesn't it look like a light? In the light, it looks like it's an LED that's lighting up. I'm talking about that right there, that little dot. Even that up there too looks pretty cool in the light. And look at the detail on this. Let me see if I can get it in focus. I'll do my best. 
Let's see. I'm trying. Try and sneak up on it slowly. It's got the number of the amount of bullets left in the pulse rifle. It says 32. You might not be able to see it because it's so small and minuscule to get the detail on the focus is hard with this camera at least. But I assure you, it says 32. Yeah, it's not gonna happen. Sorry about that, guys. <clears throat> the red. <laughs> the red looks like it's lit up too. Really amazing detail. All around. A phenomenal statue. So glad I picked up this premium format. There's no fabric on it. I know it's a premium format. It's quarter scale. <clears throat> But there you have it, number 174 out of 750, Sideshow Collectibles regular Master Chief premium format figure. I would give this a definite 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10. If it had the honeycomb, probably a 10 out of 10. But I'm giving it a 9 out of 10. That's a good score out of 10. So there's Master Chief. It is a great statue. If you have a chance at it, get it. So worth the money. Such a great piece. Huge. It's huge. I mean, look at that. That's my fridge behind it. It's humongous. It's the whole table. So, all right, guys. Enjoy playing Halo. Hopefully, there'll be a new good one coming out for the Xbox uh, One. I'll definitely be picking it up when it comes out. So keep Halo jumping, people. From the Master Chief and Statue Hunter 75, good night.